you were behind this. Where have you taken me? You don't recognize it? This is your home! The Great Clock! A marvel of science and sorcery engineered by the brightest Sony in all of existence and constructed in the exact center of the universe! Give or take 50 feet. I am curious. What lie did you tell the Zomi in your quest for vengeance? Vengeance? You think I went to all this trouble for mere vengeance? They say I'm egomaniacal. Let's just say it's all in the past. Lawrence! Right here, sir. Ready the orb of gratuitous immobilization. <laughs> Shall I prepare the mnemonic station again? No. I have a better idea. But, sir... Patience, Lawrence. We have all the time in the universe.
Space. It's huge. So huge, in fact, that if you lost your car keys in it, they would be almost impossible to find. Luckily for Ratchet, Captain Copernicus L. Quark was on the case. His mission, rescue the Lombax's one and only friend. Yep, without Clank, Ratchet was alone in the universe. Alone. 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 You realize this ship has an ejector seat, right? Sorry. I guess you could say I've been a little antsy in my pantsy at the thought of getting back into the hero business. <laughs> yep. These wild stallions have been in the stable too long. <laughs> right. Look, just keep your eyes peeled. Talon says this sector's crawling with mercenaries. Rest easy, my friend. My vigilance is both eternal and peripheral. Warning. Warning. Unidentified anomaly detected. Hang on. Shifting to evasive maneuver. We're gonna die! We're gonna die! Oh, good thing I'm wearing clean underwear! Will you shut up? We are not gonna die! Avilion, engage gravimetric stabilizers! Negative. Stabilizers offline. Thrusters offline. Landing flaps offline. Alright, so, we're gonna die. Go! Much for clean underwear. Where the heck are we? Beat me. Perhaps a leisurely stroll through this uncharted jungle will solve the mystery. Marooned on a hostile alien planet. Captain Quark realized his rescue mission would inevitably pit him against the most terrifying evil of all, nature itself.
plan, anyway? Well, where there are bridges, there are people. Where there are people, there are ships. You see where I'm going with this? Hey, that's pretty smart. You're gonna make a great sidekick. Look at this beautiful native craftsmanship. Take that, Coach. Whoa! Quark, are you seeing this? Something is seriously wrong with this planet. Uh, it's like time is all not working. I'll find another way around. You gonna be alright with those things on the loose? Please, I can handle a few tiny creatures. Size of those things? They were horrible! Come on, maybe there's a hotel around here. Concerned for his compatriot Toby, Captain Quark's metal sidekick ninja leap from stone to stone. Below him, six deadly inches of crystal blue water. His enemies vanquished. Captain Quark steals into the jungle. Blaster at the ready, prepared to deliver swift justice to those who cross his path. Seems to be the problem, citizen. My fault. We were fishing up the river when they attacked. Quark, stay here. I'll go save the children. You got it, sidekick. Smart thinking. I'll just stay here and hold the fort. Holtley is over there in that ledge. Save him! 